Assalamu alaikum. Welcome all to Easy Human Atom channel. In this video, I discuss Decidua. Decidua means the gravid endometrium. What is decidual reaction? The cell of the endometrium polyhedral and loaded with glycogen and lipid. Intercellular spaces are filled with extra vesit and tissue eat intermediates. At first, it is occur at the site of implantation, but soon spread throughout the endometrium. The part of decidua. It is divided into three part. This is decidua basalis. This is decidua parietalis, and this is decidua capsularis. This is chorion. Chorion has two part. This part is known as the chorionic fundosome. Here, chorionic villi are well developed. This part of the chorion is smooth. There is a lack of chorionic villi. So, this coronic fundosome is the fetal part of placenta, developed fetal part of the placenta and this decidua vessel is from the maternal part of the placenta. Decidua vessel is part of the decidua deep to the developing embryo which contribute to the development of the placenta. Decidua capsular is part of the decidua which surround the embryo and it's, it is separated from uterine cavity. Decidua parietalis, rest of the decidua excluding decidua basalis and decidua capsularis. So this is the difference between decidua basalis, the part of the decidua deep to a developing embryo, decidua capsularis, it surround the embryo separate from the uterine cavity and rest of the decidua excluding decidua basalis and decidua capsularis is known as the decidua parietalis. Decidua basalis it is from maternal part of the placenta, decidua cap capsularis and decidua parietalis not from placenta. You see the, this is the early part of the development, this is chorion, this is chorionic fundosome, this is chorionic leaf and this is the decidua capsularis and this is decidua basalis. When a fetus is start grow, the chorion leaf and decidua capsularis and decidua parietalis is unite and there is a the uh, uterine cavity in between decidua capsularis and decidua parietalis is not seen after the advanced stage of pregnancy. So the difference regarding chorion, decidua basalis, it is attached with the chorionic fundosome, the part of the chorion where chorionic villi are well developed, the decidua capsularis, it is attached with the chorionic leaf, the part of the chorion where chorionic villi are not well developed. Decidua parietalis, it is this part is not attached with chorion at all. So decidua, chorion and some cavity, these are confusing thing. So from within outward, we see the cavities. This is fetus. The fetus is surrounded by amniotic cavity and this is amnion and outside the amnion, this is chorionic cavity and within the chorionic cavity, the yolk sac is present and this is the chorion, this is and outside the chorion, this is the decidua, decidua capsularis parietalis and this is decidua basalis and in between the decidua capsularis and decidua parietalis, this is the uterine cavity. So we can see, uh, we can say it is uh, decidua basalis is situated in between chorionic fundosome and myometrium. 
Deciduous capsule is situated in between corneal cleave and uterine cavity, and deciduous apparatus line the wall of the uterus. So this is all about decidua and its parts and its difference. If you like this video, please press the like button, please subscribe my channel. Thank you for watching.